Hello, hello, hello everyone and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today here in Jurassic Park the Game. If you haven't checked out any of those previous episodes, click on out of this, go check them out because none of this is going to make sense. Little recap, we're here with Billy and Nima. We've been chased into the tunnels by the T-Rex. Uh, Oscar is hunting down a Velociraptor and the Hardings and Dr. Sorkin are in the tunnels as well. And now we're going to go ahead and try and see if we can turn the lights on here with Billy. We're so let's luck. go ahead and open this, this high like voltage box right up here. and see what type of damage we can do. And that was not us, thankfully. That Velociraptor is looking for Oscar here. He's got his knife. He's about to slice, dice, serve on rice. Let's see if he can do it. Ooh, look at those beautiful animations as he pulls that knife out. What's the holdup? It's nothing. It's just a different uh, model than I'm used to, is all. So, you're stuck. Let's see here. Um, this is the same panel from the movies. I think they had to push to all open. Alright, I got it now. Close your eyes. You're about to lose your... All the power. Nice. We've gone in reverse. It's gone from dark to Night even darker. Vision. Oscar is on the hunt. What's going on? Dad? Over here, Jess. It's all right. The backup generator wasn't meant to last this long, that's all. No, that's not it. We should have been fine for days. How the hell was I supposed to know open meant turn everything off? I mean, it's counterintuitive. You would know if you read the instructions. Oh, Why? they're having a little lover's spell. I think there's a dinosaur on the other side of the island that didn't hear you. Jeez. Whatever. There's a close, right? There is. Let's There's go ahead and close, close everything. There's a close, right? Yeah, I'll close that crap right up. And there we go. We've got some yeah, power that's back. that's right. Who's your... Oh, Maybe. Oh, come on. We've got the flashy lights. A little dinosaur strobe party. And apparently he sees us now. Rocky Bridges, Rock and Jurassic Park's only unofficial radio station. Just a reminder before we sign off, Parklings, if you're not on the boat by 7... You're not going to be on the boat at all. I've got a little something special for all you last minute Packers out there. Personal favorite of mine. And I'll see you all on board. Damn it, Artie. On board. Nice. He's not still here, is he? No. From the sound of it, he queued up this last bit of tape and took off. So here's a little something to get you ready to set sail. Nice. We got a little, uh, little beach dance music. Here we go, and we're gonna flight, fight this Velociraptor. Come on, Oscar, you got this. I believe in you, man. Swing and a miss. We take the headbutt, catch our knife. Nice. All right, Oscar, you got this, man. Wake up. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Another quick dodge here. Oh, nice little sucker punch there to the head. That's gonna discombobulate him. He's calling for help. We need to ramp him there. Boom. Recover. Another near miss. Swipe. Come on there, Velociraptor. Let's go. We got this. Dodge that. Slides into some boxes. Oscar, my man. Coming in strong. Another dodge. Oh, here's the kill shot. You've got that neck exposed. There we go. Ooh. Mother right into, God. I'm assuming, like the jugular. I did it. Oscar. Three more. That way. <laughs> All right. Artie, this show is over. Thank you, Dr. Laura, Sorkin. You are my new favorite person. <laughs> You've forgiven me for fixing the lysine problem? Don't push it. Holy crap, Oscar. Did you just take one of those things out by hand? Yes, he did. Uh, and we're going to go with Luke I who woke up. Sleeping Beauty woke up. Did you have to kiss her? I woke up just fine on my own, thanks. Right? You were in that tree the whole time. <laughs> of course I was. Hey, listen. When I kiss you, you'll remember it. That's never gonna happen. Oh, don't be like that. You're supposed to be at the crash site. Yeah, uh, the plan didn't factor in an angry T-Rex, so we had to change it. I didn't think to engage it in a knife fight, sorry. We had to change the plan. That's right. I unlocked the mystery behind the shaving cream can. Turns out, little Miss Sunshine here is smuggling dino embryos off the island. What? I don't buy it. 
You don't have the skills to pull off a heist like that. She knows her business, Oscar. You said the same thing about that waitress in Bogota's cooking. That wasn't her fault. That was Seminilla. They're mm. real. My client had someone on the inside, a man named Nedry. He didn't show, so they sent me to find the embryos. I'm the backup plan. Well? Squares with what I know. They're searching San Jose for this Nedry guy. Thought he was on the last boat. They can stop the search. He's dino food. Yes, he is. All right, and I Let know that guess. looks. You have a plan. Yeah, well, turns out these things are worth a lot of money to the right people. I mean, a lot. Uh... You going along with her? Hey, I'm not doing anything unless you're down. But come on, Oscar. Do you really think InGen gives a rat's ass about us? Look what happened to B-Team, to Decaf. Their families are gonna get a puny check, a gag order, and nothing else. You're pretty self-righteous for a thief. I wouldn't be a thief if you hadn't stolen this island from my people in the first place. I didn't steal anything. The Costa Rican government rented this place to InGen. And you did their dirty work, didn't you? I did my job. Just like I'm doing now. Really? And how many people are you going to kill today? Shut the hell up! Or I'll start counting with you. Whoa, whoa, Ooh. no fighting. Save it for the dinos, huh? Do I gotta remind you we're working against the clock? There's no time to save these people and be her errand boys before this place turns to ground zero. What do you mean ground zero? Nothing. We could do it, Oscar. We've got a call for another helicopter anyway, so one of us takes the eggheads back to the mainland and the other takes her to meet her contact. Let me guess. That last part would be up to you. You just tell Injian that I bought it like the rest of the guys they sent. Then you and I hook up later to split our cut. I trust you. But I don't trust her. Uh, I think we're gonna have Oscar think about it. I don't know, Billy. InGen throws a lot of work our way. Not sure I want to burn that bridge. I understand, but we're talking about a retirement level payout here. Look, you don't have to decide now. Plenty of time before we call for another chopper. All right, let's move out. Take it slow and quiet. Uh, the plot thickens, so it sounds like Oscar might be in. I guess it's going to be kind of our choice here. We'll see if he he wants to join Billy in this escapade. But time will tell. So let's see. Well, let's not start back? this yeah, again. Okay. I respect your opinion, Jerry. Although to be honest, What's I'm Jeff's a little up surprised. To? A little smoke break again. Regard for the animals. It's not that I don't care about them, Laura. It's just there are so many unintended consequences that come with your decision. Yes, she is. The Happy Punch Cigarettes. We can't keep this a secret, Laura. Shoot. We need contingency plans. I'm going to say we're going to have a friend show up here in a few minutes. Let's see who that friend is. Is it going to be the glowy eyes or the velociraptor? Where is it? I know it. Yes. Okay, let's open this lighter up. Oh, it's going to be right there. There it is. Hello, friend. Eat cigarettes. Ugh. Nasty habit smoking it is. Okay, we'll slam that door in your face. Dad, run! Jess, what's wrong? What happened? We've got company. That can open doors. Hello, Mr. Velociraptor. All right. Ooh, Jerry's got a pipe there. Oh, damn, that was quick. All right. We're going to swing at him with this pipe here. Oops, that was too quick. Jess! Damn it. Okay, I guess, uh, wow, that's the first time we've died so far this game. Um... All right, well, I am not uh, a mortal, or you know, I am a mortal, you guys can see now. All right, open that door. Let's see if we can grab this pipe a little quicker this time. All right, there we go. We got that. Now we got to be nice and slow here so Jess can get in the pipe. Swing that pipe at him, the smaller pipe, while Jess crosses the littler pipe. Um, keep them back. Jerry giving his life for everyone. All right. Ooh, okay, we're gonna get the forklift. Another big swing there. Jerry trying to knock him out of the park. There we go. Let's get this on. Yes. All right, Reverse. and go. Why are we reversing? Okay, it's up against that pipe. Smash into the boxes. Ooh, they got us there. And we're gonna ram into that one. This way. Don't come quite on, kill it, me. but it's pinned, maybe. But the other two are gonna come after us. Ooh, we gotta run here. Go, 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 go. Come on, guys. Oscar, my man. With the the headbutt again and that sure knife. Because that one a nice new scar across its the eyes. Last friend wasn't right. so lucky. That's right. You get out of here there. 
Velociraptor. Ooh, they're retreating. They're actually afraid of Oscar. What the? Amazing. I've never seen them afraid before. You're getting good at this, Jess. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thanks, Dad. That was awesome. Uh, no problem. Okay, hon. Let the man breathe. Yoder! You're alive! We're alive? I'm surprised you guys lasted five minutes without me and Oscar. Thank you. Forget it. Uh, is that blood? Oh my god, you're bleeding! Are you okay? No worries. Belongs to one of them. You killed you one? You killed one of them? With a knife? That's so badass. Well, hey, I outran a T-Rex. <laughs> Nothing. Just another fight. Uh, a raptor, a raptor tattoo. Are you gonna definitely. get a tattoo of a raptor now? I totally would. Hmm. Not a bad idea. You aren't fooling me. What <laughs> now? You can pretend to be a hero all you want, but we both know what you really are. You're right. We do. Whoa, that's not good. Got some uh, steam or water being shot out of the pipes now. Everyone, we have a problem. Uh, what's wrong, Laura? You've seen the flickering lights, now the steam eruptions. Something's gone wrong with the island's geothermal power plant. That's not our problem. When the power plant explodes, it will be. It's that bad? Everything I've read about the system says it's supposed to shut itself down if something goes wrong with the steam pressure. The fact that it hasn't means that the pressure will build unchecked. It'll pop like a balloon and take half the island with it. Uh, how do we get there? Why the power plant? Are you sure the power plant is the problem? It's the steam that clinches it for me, Jerry. The power could fail for a lot of reasons, but the steam comes straight from the power plant. Okay, uh, so let's go. Can we, how get, do we get to there? the power plant from here? I'm completely turned around. Yes, I've been here before. It's down this way. We really ought to get moving. Let's save. How do we fix it? How can we stop the power plant from exploding? We have to do something, and quickly, but I won't know exactly what until we get there. No time. Say goodbye to your dinosaurs, Doc. You can dig up the fossils later. When the power plant explodes, it'll take us with it. Unless you have a spare helicopter ready to lift off. Oh, this just keeps <laughs> getting better and better. Listen up. You're gonna show me the corridor that goes to the power plant. I'm gonna scout ahead and make sure there's no dinosaur party happening when we get there. Can I come? Oscar, my can man. I can help. You're staying right here where I can keep an eye on you. Hey! I saved you, remember? Besides, those things are afraid of him. You wandered off, Jess. Oscar doesn't mind, do you? Oscar? It is already gone. Hmm. Uh, let's go if I'm glad you when guys When I lived. saw the helicopter crash into the jungle, I thought you guys were goners. We're fine. Hey, uh, about before, the hostage thing? I'm sorry. I was only trying to protect myself. Me and the mercs, we worked it out. Worked it out? How? Don't Magically. worry about it. We're okay. Through for the now. power of money. Let's see. I outran a T Rex, or you're so you're all friends. Uh, let's go with you I outran, outran a T Rex. T-Rex, huh, Yoder? I sure did. You know, not everyone has the training to pull something like that off, let alone the raw speed. I know, right? That's what I thought when I outran her yesterday. <laughs> all right. That's great. So everyone's friends now, huh? <laughs> I wouldn't put it like that. Then how would you. <gasps> no way! Did you guys make out? We've decided that we can all work together. <laughs> Typical teenager. Let's put it that way. Hey, Oscar's back. What'd you find, buddy? Always clear, but the door to the plant is locked. Don't that just figure? Either of you got a key? I'm afraid not. How about a smoke? I wish. I swore I had some on me, but... Jess? Something to share? I'm sorry. I, I just wanted to borrow them. But, but then a dinosaur was there, and I threw them, and I think it ate them. Jessica Marie Harding! First, you get caught stealing a t-shirt from the mall. Then you steal binoculars from the park and lie about it to my face. Now you've taken Laura's cigarettes? You let the raptors get to us because you wanted to smoke? Ooh, we got ourselves a little family drama here. Okay, uh, we'll go if mom does hey, it. Mom smokes. You did too, when I was younger. That's not the point. It's not just the smoking, it's it's stealing. It's not listening. Rem Remember, the main reason you're on this island is because your mother thinks I might be able to straighten you out, somehow. Right, 
Not because you want to see me or anything. Look, you don't have to worry about me, Dad. I'm almost 15. I can take care of myself. I don't need you <laughs> or Mom or anyone. Understatement of the year. Or overstatement of the year. Oh, honey, I know it feels like that. Especially at your age. But you're not an adult. You might be a young woman. Uh, uh, physically. But emotional maturity that don't, takes time. Okay? I'm sorry, Dad, but how many times have you been married? Your kids. Have you even talked to Sarah lately? This year even? Should you be lecturing anyone about emotional maturity? Damn. Damn. <laughs> Me uh, and Billy had the same response. going to blow, right? Uh, we ain't got time for this after-school special crap. That is really not fair, Jess. Even adults don't understand everything. My point is still valid. You all right, we'll check just to make sure. It's locked, all right. Thanks for double-checking. I mean, it looks like we could bash through it, or we got a vent over here that I'm assuming that we're going to send Jess through. It may lead to the other side of the door. I hate to break it to you, Doc, but ain't none of us fitting through there. Maybe. Are those the cages from the, the Velociraptor cages from the start of the movie? An excuse doing right, things you know uh, are wrong. Let's interrupt them That's here. That's what makes me so Jerry, angry about please? this. Uh, I know you know better. Oh, they're yeah, just going to keep going, Mom huh? Mom doesn't. Please. You're not there. Really At least when I'm in trouble, she has to look up from her bridge game. All right, enough. I apologize. I'm sorry. Jess, we will finish this later. How can I help? We have a situation. The only way around the door to the power plant is that vent. And Jess is the only one of us who might fit inside. Absolutely not. My daughter has clearly shown that she can't be trusted with her own safety. She doesn't leave my sight from now on. We're just gonna have to find another salute. Jess? Jesse? Already through the vent? Jess? It's okay. Pretty sure the dinosaurs haven't been using that vent. What vent? What? What dinosaurs? Oh my god. Jess. What? Just like that. Well done, Jess. Thanks. Okay, listen up. We need to release the steam pressure to prevent any more buildup. What are we looking for? A power console. And probably a master release valve. Look, Dad, I'm sorry. I was just trying to... You were just trying to ignore everything I said! Now just stay where I can see you this time. Okay. I will. I mean it. Sorry. All right, I think that's a good place to leave you guys hanging here in the geothermal power plant. Thank you so much for coming out and watching this Tooth and Scrubs video here in Jurassic Park The Game. If you've enjoyed it, give the video a like. If you want to get great content like this on time and in an orderly fashion, be sure to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next Jurassic Park The Game video.